scary laboratory. Let's go inside. I don't think that would be safe for Stephanie. Oh, well, who cares? Stephanie, do you mind going inside? Not at all. It would be a venture. It would be a time for Pa to wrap his arms around me and save me. Yeah, Paul, if you want to earn Stephanie's love, we have to do something dangerous. I'll do it for Stephanie. Okay, then. Let's go inside. Just as the three were about to go inside, they encountered the monster of a lifetime, a giant pen! Hello. You are officially our minion. I don't know what minion means. It means that you will do whatever I say. Stop screaming, young peasant. If you scream one more time, I will cut your head off and cook it in a soup for your two little friends. <laughs> um, sorry, but I think your grandmother just died. No, Stephanie. Well, go look for her. Let's take her on this pen. I see you have found my pen. Don, don, don. I am the evil scientist that is the ruler of the world! Or soon to be. Right now, I've just been trying to tell me your laboratory. Anyways, you are my minions, or else I will cut off your heads. Okay? Got that, right? Um, I don't know if I want to be a minion. You have no choice! Pen! Yes. Go and take these guys. To the extraction tube. Actually, sir, I think I should just, you know, kill this gray one and keep the the black one for a super lab, you know, for all our evil lab coats, you know. I think the white and the black would really blend. Oh, extremely awesome observation. Yeah, that gray one would look horrible in the lab coat. Put him into the extraction chamber. Edward! Edward! Daisy! Edward! No! Edward. <sighs> Thanks so much. Now I don't have an annoying brother to worry about. Good. You, you are now our super model. Go take a shower. You stink. This is all we have time for. Whoever's watching this video. So this was Paul and Edward. And, and I'm an awesome super mom.